Hello, this is Carl, and welcome back to my Let's Play of The Wolf Among Us. This is part number four of episode number four in Sheep's Clothing. In the last episode, we, uh, the, the, the Magic Mirror has finally, the Magic Mirror has finally been repaired. I can't speak, apparently. But yeah, we're going to find out, hopefully, where the Crooked Man is. So yeah, let's get right to it. I have to say, I have been better. But thanks for putting me back together. I'm sorry, I just, I have to know. Mirror, mirror. We're glad you weren't slain. Now please show us that sick creep crane. Yeah, yeah. I want to know too. I want to see where he's ended up too. You will get on that plane to Paris, and you will wait for the day the Crooked Man needs you. Until then, not a peep. Otherwise, I get to deal with you my way. So please... Please disobey. Wait a minute. Someone's watching. What the hell? Yo! What just happened? We pointed you in the wrong direction. We looked at Bloody Mary's reflection. Oh, her. That explains the sting. I'd rather not have to feel the pain she brings. Yeah, I don't so, think most people do. Let's not do that again, okay? Looks like we'll have to track him down later. You're right. We need to focus on the immediate threat, and that's the crooked man. Big B, um, we don't have a lot of time. Right. Uh, mirror, mirror, no time to pout. So where does crooked man hang out? I don't recognize the door, but that's the Crooked Man symbol on it. Hold on. Where's it going? Oh yeah, I forgot it jumps as well. The door. It moves. what I tell you? Wait a minute. I know that door. That's Central Park. I don't know when it's gonna move again, but I'm gonna get there before it does. Bigby, wait. When you get the Crooked Man, Make sure you bring him back alive. All right, fair he enough. Has to stand trial. Right. You can't just dispense street justice. I know that emotions can run high. I'll bring him and back alive. Your reasons to handle this a certain way. I'll catch him and bring him back here alive. Then we can clean him and cook him together. Good. I have enough to worry about here while I prepare the case against him. So I'm going to trust you to handle this properly. That is, if you think you're ready. Yeah, I'm ready. let's do this. I got no other choice. I've got a lot of time, so let's skip the conversation. I need to get to that damn door quickly before he disappears. Because, well, luckily we're not under, well, we are under the time schedule now because it moves, but we don't know how long the schedule is. Go, 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 go. There it is. Wow, let's do this. Uh, let's kick it. Let's kick it open. Ho ho ho! God damn! All right, run! Who the hell? Who's this? Tim. What the hell are you doing here? Who are you? Good evening, Sheriff. I'm here to take you to the boss. Thanks, by the way. Uh, shake hand. For leaving off Tiny. I have to admit, when they asked me to watch the door, I wasn't sure what to expect when you came through that portal. Kind of small for a god. here on a social call. Hey. Hold on. You've just been waiting for me to show up? You knew I was coming? That's what they told me. I don't know, they said you made it pretty clear. I'm supposed to bring you right on in, so... If you'll come this way... Well, let's do look, this. This is the one thing I have to do. Fine, lead on. Nice place! <laughs> Thanks for understanding. This is all I'm here to do, and I don't want to mess it up. 
Fair enough. I know I'm probably the last person you'd expect to be a guard. I get it. You have a job to do. But you gotta ask yourself if you want to be involved with this guy. Whatever you may think of him, he doesn't treat me like some broken little kid. Fair Don't enough. That's what it's like. Oh, he's he called the crooked man. And I'm lucky to have it. This is the only option I've got. Just keep that in mind, maybe. Um. If you go up against each other. The rest of Fable Town is gonna get caught in the middle. I understand the position you're in, but you don't have to do this. There are other things you could do. So it's just that easy? Maybe not, but you don't want to be a part of this. A lot of us depend on him. Some of us never get to the front of the line at the business office. But he's there. We need you, but we need him too. What we don't need is a war. Alright, fair enough. Hey Sheriff, hold up! All I right. gotta go in with you. Thanks. <laughs> oh, we're here. Put here. That was quick. What did I tell you? Uh, you first. Go ahead. You got a job to do. I ain't shit. Sheriff Wolf, sir. Here I am, boys. But here, all the squads here. We got the Jersey Devil. We got Georgie. We got the Dom. We got Dom and D. We got all the brothers. I know the sheriff isn't the accommodating sort, but you handled it. You did well. You can go now. Thank you, sir. All right. You see, everyone in Fable Town has a role to fill. You just have to pay attention to what they need to help them find it. How are we going to do this then? Why don't you have a seat, Sheriff? We have a great deal to discuss. You know what? Why, let's talk. Alright, you got me here. Let's talk. Oh, ho, ho, ho. wait, don't tell me that's it. Are you kidding me? But is that it? This is it? Oh, it is. All right, I'll be quiet for this bit. I've heard stories about you. In the old days, how you picked off those men one by one. Oh, how they screamed. The wolf is coming. And they would wait. Hiding anywhere they could squeeze their pathetic, shivering corpses. Some would just drop to their knees where they stood, close their eyes, and wait for death. And you'd give it to them. <laughs> I wish I could have seen it. <sighs> oh well. <clears throat> well. That didn't, like, give me a lot of, um... That... Usually with these next times you can kind of tell what's going on, but with that with that one I didn't really t get what was going on then. But anyway, um, okay, so here's the choices. Did you send Colin to the farm? You would 85.5% of the place decided to not send Colin to the farm. Lovely. Did you uh, re attempt to remove Nerissa's uh, ribbon? You and 63.8% of the place did not try to remove it. You were in, which crooked operation did you investigate first? You and 63.2% of the place went to the court above first. Um, did you send Toad to the farm? You and 73.3% of the players decided not to go to the farm. How did you respond to the crooked man? You and 41.8% of the players agreed to talk with him first. So, I was in a minority for that one. So, more people like, most people either threatened him, didn't answer him, or said you were coming with me. God damn. Didn't actually f see that coming, to be honest. But, yeah. Who? Um... So yeah, that was episode 4 of The Wolf Among Us in Sheep's Clothing. So yeah, um, the next episode, episode 5, will be the finale, the last episode. Well, obviously not in terms of parts-wise, we've still got like another 3 to 4 parts left, but in terms of episode-wise in this game, the next episode is the finale. So, you get, it is more likely than not, the next episode is going to be kind of crazy. But yeah, I'm looking forward to it anyway. But yeah, I'll be really hope you have enjoyed this episode as much as I did playing it. 
Hope you join me in the next episode for the, the start of the finale of Season 1 of The Wolf Among Us. But yeah, hope you have enjoyed this episode as much as I did playing it. But yeah, for now, thanks for watching everyone, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.